There are two nifty tricks that you can use to create dummy documents quickly. The two tricks are called RAND and LORAM, and I'll be using them in this course. The first, RAND, is a simple formula that you enter. You have to be at the start of a line. You can't have other letters before this. Type equals and then RAND, R-A-N-D, for random. This is going to look a lot like an Excel formula. Open the parentheses, put the number of paragraphs of text you want, a comma, and the number of sentences, not lines, but sentences, in each paragraph. Close the parentheses, and when I press Enter in a moment, Word will go to the Microsoft Word help file to a specific spot and will begin taking paragraphs and sentences and pulling them back into the document. But it happens really fast. Five paragraphs, six sentences per paragraph, just like that. A really quick and easy way to get text. This text is somewhat intriguing, and if we use this text to make some decisions or to decide about things like formatting, as we'll do in this document and in others, people might want to read this text because it is English, and they immediately will say, oh, on the Insert tab, and they'll begin to try to learn things. So if we want text that isn't even this interesting, isn't even as interesting as the RAND text is, the other choice is instead of RAND, we can use the word LORAM. So I'm going to type equals lorem, 5 comma 6. And when I press enter, I will get a set of filler text. This is text that looks a lot like Latin. It's not actually good Latin, but it's semi-Latin. It was created by adding and removing letters from a translation of Cicero, either 40 years ago or 400 years ago. No one's really sure. Although it's not actually Latin, its purpose is for typesetting because letters appear in this sample text in roughly the same frequency that they appear in regular text. So you can use this kind of text that's called lorem ipsum in order to dummy up a document that you can then make some decisions about. And no one really feels like reading it very long because it doesn't look like real text that one would read for any reason unless one were a quasi-Latin scholar. So the two commands, again, to create this kind of text are equals rand, paragraphs and sentences, and then equals lorem, in parentheses, paragraphs, sentences. You don't need to be able to use rand and lorem to use Word, but if you need to create some sample text quickly to look at page designs or layouts, other visual elements, or to create or test a template, RAND and LORAM will do the trick.